face is a full face of a brand I ain't ever fucking heard of. And today on the chopping block is Vive Beauty. We have a lot of goodies here. I tried to practically get everything I could from the website. Okay, I did my brows off camera. We're going to start with the Skin Nova Instant Radiance Primer. It says it gives a golden hour glow to the skin. Now, it says the product is vegan and cruelty-free, and it says it's made in Korea, which is like fire. Okay, I'm going to apply a few pumps of this product. I can already tell that this is going to give me some sort of golden hour effect on my skin. It also does not appear to have any, like, added fragrance. Okay, here it is on the skin. It feels very, very lightly tacky, which is good for underneath makeup. I like the glow, I like that my skin feels plump and hydrated. They don't have a foundation, so I'm just going to use Estee Lauder Double Wear. Okay, next product is this Modern Bronzer Duo. I got shade Medium. I'm going to use this to add warmth to the face. This is melting into my skin. Where is this made? Italy. Makes sense. <laughs> so yeah, if you didn't know, brands typically don't make their products all in one place. They typically, you should make it where they do it best. So like, you know, Korea does great skincare. Italy does great powder products. This is a powder bronzer, but it's so buttery that it almost melts into the skin when you use it on top of creams. I really like the color too. It's like perfect. I was a little scared because it's shade medium, but it's really working for me. They do have a concealer, but they were sold out in my shade, so I'm just going to use one of my Hourglass ones. Gorgeous packaging. This is the Modern Powder Perfecta. It's just a pressed setting powder, and I'm going to use it to set underneath my eyes. Wow. That made my... I'm going to do my chin too. That made my under eyes look flawless. Whoa, this is very nice. That's making me look plastic. <laughs> Little on the forehead. That's a very good powder. Like the coverage that I didn't expect that. Okay, this is probably what I'm most excited about. The Sunset Blush Bombs. Look at this packaging. That is super cute. Okay, so the packaging says it's a light, buildable liquid blush that adds a natural veil of radiant color. It says if you want a bolder color, you will have to build which I would technically prefer. I don't want to start off with too much, and then I might ruin my makeup. These are the three colors I got. I think I'm going to use this middle one. It's called Rosa. I'm going to start off slow and then build it up, and I'm going to blend it in with my fingers. I just feel like it's that kind of formula. I think this product would be better with no foundation because it has completely lifted off the foundation where I placed the product. If I had more natural makeup on, I think I could make it work, but it's not working for me right now. Okay, go to pat two. 